In today's video, I'm going to be sharing a working strategy on how to run a successful ADS arbitrage and also show you guys how to buy traffic from Joomla if I pronounce it very well. I'm going to be sharing a working strategy and share a diagram that is going to help you to run a profitable ADS arbitrage and this method is on tap because I've seen a lot of people doing mistakes, buying traffic and wasting their money without being on profit. So if you want to be on profit when it comes to ADS arbitrage, pay attention to this video and i'm going to show you guys how to run a successful ads arbitrage free of charge make sure you watch this video to the end and subscribe to my channel if you have not done that and turn the notification bell when I, once i update anything concerning adsense ads seo getting it. before i show you guys on how to create a campaign on joomla you need to pay attention to this diagram i'm going to explain it and if you skip this particular section of this video that means you did not watch this video because this is the most important part that is going to help you to be successful even without running ad on joomla using this method and adding it to other traffic source you are using you're going to be on a profit side so pay attention so if you look at this diagram this is self-explanatory but i'm still going to explain this diagram for a lot of people be it newbie or whatever if you're still confused on this diagram then pay attention you don't even need to fast forward or skip any part of this video pay attention now this is a banking traffic system that's what i call it a banking traffic system is a way you collect user data user information or make users to subscribe to your website so you can be able to send them broadcasts. so when it comes to uh, traffic banking we have um, different user behavior what they correspond to and inside that particular traffic banking system we have two systems we have push notification system where you put a push notification on your website that is going to pop up to tell the user to subscribe to push notification to get the latest update why the news uh, email uh, pop-up uh, traffic system is mainly going to work for tier, top tier one country because they like reading email you can be able to send them email for a fresh latest content so if you are targeting asia and african country use push notification uh traffic banking system on your website so let me explain this very well now let's say for example this is a platform where you are buying traffic you buy um, about 10,000 uh, users that convert to your travel content and when they come to your website they subscribe to your traffic banking system now you send a broadcast to those bank traffic you have already banked to a fresh content that still relates travel let me explain this very well this is a system to reduce your spending in ads now, if you want to run a successful arbitrage without organic traffic, you need a banking traffic system. I know your mentor will not tell you this. I'm using this mentor, this uh, sorry, I'm using this particular method, and it's really working. Now, what you're going to be doing is you are buying traffic and bank those traffic. So, what is going to happen is when you are sending a broadcast, you are also what buying more traffic to another content that will lead to travel which is travel content let's say for example you write a content about how to travel to uxa and you also have a, a content about how to travel to canada or how to apply for canada uh, scholarship something like that and you run a campaign on it what happens is when once you send ten thousand people to that particular content they convert out of the ten thousand it to seven thousand or five thousand people let's just use that particular example are going to subscribe to your traffic banking system so these uh, broadcasts when you come to broadcast you can set your broadcast to run every 24 hours or daily which is normal so if you are going to be running a campaign for average fifty dollar for daily once you bank a lot of traffic let's say for example at the end of the month you bank because very first time which is the the big from the beginning of the month to the end of the month you're not going to stay on profit your your re returning on investment is going to be very low let's be very very honest to ourselves so if you want to run a good uh, arbitrage system please pay attention don't skip 
I know most of you would like to brush your legs. Maybe you're going to be using tax website, which is not proper. This is a white hat method that I'm teaching here. Uh, most people do use um, what they call uh, proxy to click on their campaign to increase their returning on investment, which is very, very bad. If you want to stay in this business and stay as a pro, and as an expert to make a lot of profit, you need to use a banking traffic system. So let's say for example, from the beginning of the month to the end of the month, all you do is buying traffic, banking it, buying traffic, banking it. In less than one month, let's say for example, you have end up banking 40,000 uh, free users, for example. Now, what happened is you have half extra uh, traffic because one thing you need to understand for sure is that one traffic source when it comes to arbitrage is not going to be profit. What I mean, this is the reason why most people that have organic traffic are winning when it comes to arbitrage because the organic traffic level up the return on investment to go high. So with zero organic traffic and you're not using a banking traffic system, you're not going to be on profit. You're going to be losing a lot of money. And this is the reason why most of you are complaining when it comes to running arbitrage uh, with that organic traffic on your ADS website. Now, even AdSense, if you want to stay on profit, you have to have multiple channel of traffic. But to reduce the stress of going for optimizing a website to rank a website to get organic traffic use a banking traffic system so what happened is these users if you send these particular users to this content and you bank them for good one month what is going to happen in the next one month you're going to start sending a uh, broadcast to this total user to new fresh content daily retaining content that still relate to what the users want when it comes to travel be it loan or whatever and remember let's say for example you are spending average um 50 dollar daily or let's say for example 20 dollar daily every day on campaign in the first month you are spending 20 dollar let me uh, do this very well you spend average 20 dollar daily from the beginning of the month okay the first month you start the arbitrage to the last month you are spending $20 and remember you are banking users the next month you are going to start to reduce your spending limit to be $10 and remember when you are spending this $20 they are likely not to go uh, more than times two your revenue are not going to go more than times two most time you're going to even see one point times 1.9 or even one so you're not going to be seeing more uh, much uh, returning on investment your returning on investment is going to be poor in the beginning of the month because you have one traffic sucks this is the hard truth a lot of people are not telling you and this is the reason why most people use self-clicking uh, task website a lot of things blah 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 to do a lot of things out there which is ethical is not that good so if you really want to do something very unique traffic banking is going to help so most people are going to train their mindset to go as high as two moons to be on lost side believe me you're going to lose money the, the traffic you're sending to this website are not going to be profit and remember your profit should be ringing on the users you are bank banking so what happened is if you are spending average 20 dollar daily on your campaign every day on your campaign for the first month you start the arbitrage what happens is the next month you reduce it to ten dollar daily now with the ten dollar you're going to be spending on your campaign daily in the next month or the next uh, third month what happens is you're going to be sending newsletter broadcast to these uh users you have already banked to fresh content which you are going to automate to send a podcast for a fresh content every single day and why you reduce your campaign cost to ten dollar and what is going to happen that this your returning on investment is going to skyrocket to what skyrocket to seven ten eleven returning on investment believe me this is a working strategy and i'm doing it currently and i don't need to show you my ads account but believe me this is a working strategy and it's 100 percent guarantee and if you try this particular method come back and give me your testimony so this is just the simple way to run arbitrage and using a traffic banking system 
to be on profit but mind you if you have um organic traffic you can ignore a banking traffic system but if you are not uh, with enough organic traffic banking system uh, the traffic banking system is going to help a lot let me explain this again if you don't use what they call this traffic banking system what means is that every single month you are going to be on lost profit and keep on buying the same user to your content buying them every single day buying the same user you buy today you buy them tomorrow to fresh content buy them next tomorrow and your campaign keep on losing CTR and now listen to what I'm trying to explain here if you buy this user to come to your website without banking them with the uh, with the um, traffic banking system what what is going to happen is every single day you keep on buying the same user the same amount and this is the reason why a lot of people fell this is the reason why a lot of people are not on profit when it comes to arbitrage so if you want to be on profit banking system traffic banking system is going to increase your return on investment and reduce your ad costs per day and you are going to be on profit what happened is these users are going to become your free users you're not going to be buying them any longer the few ones you are buying that, that is coming to this content with the free uh, banking system you use here are going to be sending traffic to fresh content what you're going to be do, doing is to automate uh, 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 automate a fresh content every single day while sending them to your banking users and while you are running your ad and reduce your ad spending and you're going to be on profit let's move on the section of creating a campaign on joomla let's go the last section of this video is to create a campaign from joomla so the first thing we're going to talk about is the funding system which we can easily fund here so when it comes to the funding system if you look very closely you can easily fund fifty dollar hundred dollar but for me this is a business you are doing if you want to start very pretty well you should go for uh, if you want to fund with visa uh, mastercard you need to go with uh, fifty dollar to hundred dollar to five hundred dollar so if you want to go with paypal uh, i also think it's the same procedure if you want to go with interim uh, you need to start with fifty dollar to hundred dollars so the same system so whichever one you want to choose from the funding system is very very easy for everybody around the world please i'm not advertising joomla uh one thing i will encourage you in terms of traffic source is when you are looking for traffic source there is nothing like perfect traffic source so you just need to take your time to analyze the one that is working for you so the main topic of this video is traffic banking so remember the uh, the the diagram we have i have already explained about traffic banking and what traffic banking start to benefit you in the first month it may not be profitable so along the line you need to use the traffic banking and reduce your campaign spending and increase your revenue to times five to whatever you want to increase it to okay so let's let's move to create a campaign so i'm going to click the create campaign which is the campaign side i'm going to add a new campaign just add a new campaign after funding uh the language first thing we need to do is to give our company name so let me give it my youtube channel name please wpsu and then the next thing i'm going to choose is english language because the content we are promoting is based on english content so if you are promoting arabic content fine and other country korea whatever uh turkey whatever turkish all of them i so one thing again you need to understand you need to put the amount you want to spend daily so we can go as high as 30 dollar in most cases they are going to tell you to spend 50 dollar daily in my experience you're not going to spend more than 50 dollar daily okay so before you talk about bidding per click please you need to choose the country you want so you can easily come back so when it comes to the content uh choosing the um, target vertical uh, verticals or whatever if I'm not pro if I pronounce it very well so let's say for example we're talking about travel and you know uh, real estate for that example so we can be able to go for let's say for example the content we are promoting is travel so the next thing here we're talking about is the country so which is Nigeria for example and we're going to pick Nigeria then go back again and put our targeted yeah, CPC. So our target CPC for Nigeria, they are selling it for 0 0.03 cents. 
so we can go as 0 0.02 this is okay for me then the next thing I'm going to do here is to put more options now I'm not going with all traffic on all devices choose mobile please you can create a second campaign targeting the same audience and choose tablet and uh, uh, whatever desktop so for me I'm choosing all device how much do you want to spend on the cut uh, on the campaign well just leave this thing not set and then if you have a UTM tracker and a standard tracker Google tracker you can put it in here so I'm going to click the save button they said that I should put $50 which I told you guys $50 is what they would tell you to put for daily spending which you're not going to spend more than that so I'm going to click save then we're going to be taken to the last step where we're going to put our teaser which they, some people call it some ad company call it teaser why some ad company call it creative ad copy something like that so i'm going to put ad and put uh the you know the title of the content that i want to promote for example and put your url for example and put the description for example you can put the description of your content then second the brand name for example let me put maybe something like this for example which is your brand name which maybe this is your brand name so the next one is to upload the image or uh, creative for you, what you want to promote so this is how to create a campaign on joomla which is quite easy like others that i've been sharing but the main topic of this video is traffic banking to utilize and increase and scale up your arbitrage system so if you really want to increase your ads earning traffic banking is one of the easiest way to make it very easy and if you don't want to go the process of traffic banking getting a website that have organic traffic is a game changer for it all but when it comes to the aspect of traffic banking you take a time to bank traffic bank it for good one month or less than one month and then the second month you lower your spending and start using podcasts to increase the source of the traffic why the podcast is coming in why the pay traffic is coming in the opportunity that is going to take place is going to go uh, to give you more returning on investment thank you guys for watching and i wish you guys good luck and if you intend to contact me for consultation or for my premium course then you are free check the description you're going to see my contact see you in my next video peace